Happy New Year, everyone! It is 2023 now, and it's time for the very first video of the year. And it's my pleasure to present you with another amazing Minecraft plugin. And today, that is Daily Rewards Plus. A plugin that adds daily rewards to your Minecraft server. It is very customizable, very easy to understand. So before we start the video, make sure to press that subscribe button and click on the notification bell. Most people who watch my videos are actually not subscribed to the channel, even though you're just a single click away. Just just a single click and you'll actually help me out a lot and then without any further ado let's dive right into this Now, if you want to download and install Daily Rewards Plus for yourself, there will be a link in the description of this video that will take you to the Spick and MC page. Do know, though, that you will need to be locked in with a Spick and MC account, otherwise you will not be able to see the page. So create an account, purchase the plugin, drag it into your plugins folder, restart your server, and after that, upon joining, you will see this message. You will have a daily reward waiting to be claimed. Click here to claim your reward. Okay, let's click. Here we got the daily rewards menu. It goes all the way from 1 to 30. Now the call blocks here mean that you're not able to claim the reward yet. So here we got day 1. A reward awaits. Click me to claim your prize. Now beneath that we can see exactly what the reward is. So no reward today. Okay, reward unclaimed. Then we left click and the reward is claimed now. We got absolutely nothing. That's great. <laughs> I guess. You'll get a message. You have claimed your daily reward. Check back tomorrow to continue your streak. Now to get inside of that menu more easily, we can just type slash daily in chat, press enter and there you go. So now you can see that we've claimed this reward. And the next reward, the reward from day 2, waits 23 hours and some minutes and some seconds before it will appear. So after exactly a day, we will be able to claim reward 2. And then when we wait an additional 24 hours, we will be able to claim reward 3. A 4, and 5, and 6, and so on until 30. Now, like you saw, we got nothing for the first day. Of course, we want something. And the nice thing about Daily Rewards Plus is that you can edit everything in-game. So, of course, you can go to the config file and change it there, but in-game is just as easy. Hi there, kind viewer. Quick message from future Kasasora. This video is sponsored by the creator of Daily Rewards Plus. And because he's an extremely kind fella, we will be giving away three free copies of Daily Rewards Plus. The only thing you guys have to do is post your Spigot MC username in the comments of this video. And by doing that, you will have a chance of winning this awesome plugin. Now, back to the video. All you need to do is type slash daily edit like that. Press enter. Please select the config you wish to in-game edit. We can edit the config.yml and the rewards.yml. I'm going for the rewards one. Left click. And now you will see all the days here. We can scroll with this button here at the bottom. So we can go all the way to 30. Now let's go and edit the reward for day two. So click on edit rewards. And here on top, you can see the reward name, then the reward icon and the reward command. So these three things here is what you want to change. On day two, I want to get a diamond. I'm just going to type a diamond. Okay, the reward name is a diamond, then the reward icon. I'm gonna go for diamond, okay. And then we need to add a command line. To do that, you want to press on this text here, just left click. And after that, you want to click on add a command. So just press on this text, add a command. And now the only thing you have to do is type the command. So now we need to type a command that gives the player a diamond. So I'm gonna type gif. After that, one of these icons, player name and then the other one i don't know what you call them brackets arrows whatever you know what i mean so we got gif player name diamonds and then one that's the command to receive a diamond press enter and there we go when we now go to the daily rewards menu you can see the reward is a diamond now i still need to wait 24 hours before i can claim it but that takes way too long so i'm just gonna skip time for a bit to skip time we're gonna type slash daily set streak then i'm gonna change my streak and i'm gonna set it to one and when we now check back on daily you can see that i'm now able to claim the reward for day two your reward awaits Click me to claim your prize. The icon is a diamond. It says a diamond. And when we claim it, we get a diamond. How cool is that? Now, of course, you can have multiple rewards. And what's really, really cool is that the reward can be anything. So 
It can be a Minecraft item, but a reward can also let you teleport to a location in the world, for example. Because you can just enter a command. If you have a plugin on your server that adds loot crates, you can, for example, hide one of the loot crate keys inside of a daily reward. If you have custom items on your server, you can hide a custom item inside of these daily rewards. So it's pretty much compatible with everything, which is very cool. Now, something that makes this plugin absolutely awesome as well is that you can edit pretty much the whole config file in game so by typing daily edit again but this time going to config.yml you can see all of these categories here so we got general claiming rewards reward chests player join event and reward guis okay let's go to general configuration click on it and here we just got some general settings so should you print errors into the console True or false? Should it print extra details into the console? True or false? I'm gonna change that to true actually. Then the plugin prefix. I'm just gonna make everything gold. So daily rewards. I'm going to type out plus and then I'm going to do it like this. Enter. Okay, cool. You can also change the GUI title. Should it check for updates or not? And if you go back here, you can change other settings as well. Now, by going inside of the actual config file, you will see some more information. So if you don't exactly know what something means, then checking it out in the actual config might be more appealing to you. So reset when streak completed. If you don't know what it means, it will explain it here. So when a player reaches day 30, should you reset the daily streak, blah, blah, blah. It's cool. Just more information. I think everything here in the config file is really, really clear. It's explained extremely well. You can also make a daily rewards chest. To do that, type slash daily chest set. Enter. Bam daily rewards now when you open it i can't because i already claimed everything that's great so i'm gonna set my streak to day zero and now when we open it we will actually get a cool animation look at that day one no rewards today awesome nothing great now when we set my streak to one i can actually claim another reward Ooh, there we go the diamonds and we got it. Look what a solid animation that is. Now there are actually multiple animations. So you can choose whatever one you want. So by going to daily edits. Then to the config. After that reward chests. Here you got chest animation. It is pop out. We can change to GUI, lightning, Christmas. Or none for some reason. Why would you want that? So let me show you all of them. Here we got GUI. Open it. And this is what it looks like. And here we got Christmas. Ooh, that's cool. That's a very cool animation. And last but not least, we got lightning. Those animations are really freaking cool. Now you can also let players automatically claim their rewards as soon as they join the server, for example. I wouldn't do that, but you can do it if you want. You can also turn the reminder on and off and what the interval is per reminder that will be sent to the player. And then you can also change things like how many rows the inventory should have, what an unready reward should look like, what a missed reward should look like, what a claimed reward should look like, and what a future reward icon should look like. In other words, lots of customization. And that's all you guys will be it for today. I really, really hope you enjoyed watching this video. And thanks so much to the creator of Daily Rewards Plus for sponsoring this video. I think your plugin is absolutely amazing now if you want to purchase daily rewards plus for yourself link will be in the description of this video do remember you need to be locked into a spigot mc account really important otherwise you will not see the page and then i would love to ask you to leave a like on this video and also press subscribe most people who watch my channel are not subscribed even though you're just a single click away and that single single click will make me an extremely happy man and then i hope you have an amazing day and i will see you in the next one bye bye